Want to make your browsing more private and secure on your iPhone? With iOS 26, the Google Chrome app includes built-in privacy and security settings that you can easily customize. Let's go through each option so you know exactly how to protect your data. First, open the Chrome app on your iPhone. Make sure you're signed into your Google account. On the main page, tap your profile icon in the top right corner. This opens the settings menu. Scroll down to the bottom and tap privacy and security. You'll now see a list of tools you can turn on or off. Let's break them down one by one. The first option is delete browsing data. Tap this if you want to clear your search history, cached files, cookies, and other activities stored in Chrome. This is especially useful if you're troubleshooting website issues or want a fresh start for privacy. Next is safe browsing. Tap it to choose your level of protection. You can pick standard protection for basic safety or enhanced protection for stronger defense against dangerous sites, downloads, and phishing attempts. Below that, you'll find the switch for always use secure connections. When enabled, Chrome will automatically try to load websites using HTTPS, the safer and encrypted version of a site. It will also warn you before visiting a page that doesn't support it. This setting is highly recommended. Another useful feature is handoff. When turned on, you can start browsing a site on your iPhone, then seamlessly continue where you left off on your Mac. This is great for productivity if you switch between devices often. If you use incognito mode, Chrome also gives you extra privacy controls. You can enable lock incognito tabs, so they require Face ID or Touch ID the next time you reopen Chrome. You can even set Chrome to always ask if you want to open links from other apps directly in incognito. Finally, there's lockdown mode. This feature offers extreme optional protection and should only be used if you believe you might be targeted by highly sophisticated cyber attacks. When lockdown mode is enabled, Chrome blocks certain web technologies. The trade-off is that some sites may load more slowly or not function correctly, so only use it when absolutely necessary. And that's it. With just a few minutes of setup, you can make browsing on Chrome safer, more private, and tailored to your needs. If this video helps you configure Chrome's privacy settings on your iPhone, give it a like and check out my other iOS 26 tutorials to get even more control over your apps and data. Thanks for watching.